I'm just ready for someone to comment and be like, the 80s called. They want their hair back. <sighs> hey y'all. So if you guys don't already know, or if you're new here, I'm a college student. And when people think college, they think drinking, partying, other things with alcohol. Alcohol is a prominent thing in college culture. So me as a college student, I obviously drink like a shit ton all the time, get wasted every weekend, a duck. Because obviously I'm a college student. So that means also me being a blonde makes me a dumb-headed bimbo. Right? Hashtag stereotyping. As you can tell, I'm a big drinker. JK, this is my roommate. This is mine and I bought these back in October when I turned 21, so I've had them for seven months almost. And uh, I still got over half of the 12 pack left. I had three over the last three nights because it's almost finals week. Hardy, hardy. As I said, I've been 21 for over half a year and I have never been drunk and I've never set foot at a college party and I actually never plan to. I'm not dissing drinking alcohol at all as long as you do it responsibly. I think it is fine. But most college students don't do it responsibly. I drank before I was 21, as in I would have like a glass of wine at Thanksgiving or Christmas, and that was it. Well, I had a whole bunch of friends in high school who were like, "Woo!" So yes, being a college student and not being a partier or a drinker isn't actually that good because drinking is so prominent in like college culture. I'm actually kind of weird. I know, me, weird. <laughs> Talking to a camera? I'm not weird. These are just a few of the things that I have to deal with the fact that I'm not a crazy drinker, partier person thing. Number one, the crazy freshman. Like when I was a freshman, the last thing I was thinking about was going to parties. I was freaking out over the fact that I was in college, I had academics to worry about. I was in college to learn, I know, crazy thought. And most freshmen come in and they're like, independence, freedom, you do what we want. And that's exactly the point. And you get to choose how you want to do with that. And a lot of them don't do it very wisely. People need to fit in. I never fit in in high school. I was always the oddball out and I still have yet to find a click. I'm a loner. I don't like to hang out with people. When I was in high school, I was told that I was going to drink in college by my classmates who drank. They're like, oh, you're gonna drink in college once you get to college. Totally, absolutely. Be yourself, you don't need alcohol to have fun. Or at least I don't, usually. I might need one drink to go party hardy at the club, but just one and I'm gonna be like After just one. Because I'm an introverted sociopath who despises human touch. So that's why I don't even go to clubs at all anyway. I'm like sweating, it's so hot in here. People think that they're better than you because they drink. They like have to just like be dominant and arrogant about their drinking and it just drives me nuts. Because drinking a liquid makes you better than me. Hashtag college logic. When people talk about their partying and their drinking in a very discreet, very like hush hush way because they, they don't want to know that I was doing it and 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 like she doesn't drink so she's gonna like like I don't know she's gonna like tell my mom like, yeah, that party last night. Oh, oh my God. That party was like so killer. Got it with my fake ID. And like, it was totally cool. Oh crap, she's looking at us. What do we do? Oh my God. Oh my God. What? Hi. <laughs> like, just the fact that people think I'm stupid enough to not know what they're talking about. What do you think I'm gonna do? Call your mom and be like, oh yeah, so and so is drinking, just thought I'd let you know that. Crowded bars, can't do it, can't, can't do it. Bar life, not for me. It's freaking expensive. Like, I don't understand how people can buy like armfuls of really expensive alcohol. This is like the only pack of alcohol I have ever bought. I would rather eat food. I'd rather be able to pay for college than buy alcohol. Thank you. When people seek hangover sympathy. I do not care if you went and got completely shit-faced Wasted, three sheets to the wind. It's your life, you do what you want. Don't come to me the next morning looking for sympathy. Like, come sit beside me in class and like, I got so drunk last night and I got such a killer headache today. I am like so hungover. I'm just gonna like 
openly give you a judgy look and not care. Be like, hey, you put that on yourself, you got wasted, you deal with the consequences, bro. I, you have to be drunk to enjoy drunk people, I think is, is the case, and I don't get drunk, so I don't enjoy drunk people. My main thing with being 21 is getting to go into the bars to pick up my friends to drive them home. I actually really enjoy being a DD because I know my friends are safe and they're not trying to drive home when they're totally gone. And usually they're happy drunks, so they say they love me and that I'm the best friend ever. Totally boost your self-esteem. You should try it sometime if you haven't. Being a DD is a seriously rewarding experience. I absolutely love doing it. <laughs> I don't know many people who say that. <sighs> That's so strange. That's all I have for you guys today. Be sure to check out last week's video. I'm going to China in two weeks, so you guys got one more video for me before I'm on a two week vacay. And that was odd. Be sure to follow my blog. I'm gonna leave a link below. And like this video if you enjoyed it. If you can relate, if you're a person who doesn't really drink in college, kudos to you. If you're like, wow, she's an idiot because she doesn't drink, I'm used to that, man. Whatever. And be sure to subscribe for more videos on Sundays if you haven't already. Join this awesome community of awesome people. We'll hope to see y'all next time. Bye. Damn, son. Isn't that enough?